What's better for self-defense? A hammer or a machete? What do you say? Machete. Machete? What do you say? I say machete too. What do you say? Machete. You all say machete. Mm -hmm. I think it's the hammer. In this video, we're going to talk about hammer versus machete, which is better for self-defense. What are my requirements for a self-defense weapon? What the hell? I like... He likes machetes. He's got I do like machetes. I don't mind a machete. Uh, here's, my, here's my thing. The thing is... Um, my requirements for a self-defense weapon, I like it to be one-handed, and I would like it to do damage even if a person does this. Like they hold their hands up to block, I want it to still do disabling damage. It's one of my gripes about the knife, is the knife works great, better than any of this stuff from here, yep. or from scenarios where I've already kind of fucked up. I've already made several mistakes for the knife to start shining. We're talking about some sort of Scenario where you do have some reactionary gap, maybe home invasion or like someone's busted in your door or, you know, you know that you're about to have to defend yourself against someone. I like it to be one-handed, do damage to the arms, legs, hands, whatever, because people are inherently going to block their head. Wouldn't you rather have those, though? The machete? Chop the fingers off. You put your hands up, that, you might be able to catch that block then. You put your hands up to that thing, that's going in your hand. It seems like there's more of a sliced. chance with this. Like if you swing, if you swing really hard with that, mm -hmm. I mean, I don't know. It doesn't seem as scary as this shit right here. Like yeah. it coming down. But that's uh, why they would grab it. You yeah, still do damage. I feel like, like I can time that a little bit, but if like, I fuck up, it's gonna. I know it's gonna hurt. This. But if I fuck up on that, it's like there goes your fingers. It goes hands. in your hand. Goes in your. Do you know? And I feel like people that would carry that would have, probably have a pretty sharp because they. Why do you have a machete anyway? <laughs> right, so one upside, let's look at, I'll, I'll start with my pros. I'll tell you why I like this better it's next. Still, it's still going. Let's talk about why this is better. All right, there's a perfect example. Like, like you, you, you're not going to grab this and take this from yeah. me. This, you might grab and we get into a wrestling match, yep. right? Which I have answers for. We'll cover a little bit of them later, but I'm working on a whole hammer martial arts system for no reason. It's not real, <laughs> but it's just a thing I'm doing. <laughs> If Jay moves to grab this, don't here. We'll use this one. All right. This is not real. Do right. the movie thing where you catch it in between. Oh yeah, you can do that. <laughs> See if you can do that. Oh. oh. Nope. <laughs> Just I grabbed me in the face. I went slow. Ah. Uh, no, but even like grabbing here, like that's that's not yeah. Uh, that's not gonna work. <laughs> You're so not trying. so point machete. I'll give a point to the machete on that. Um, another thing about it is. If we talk about, I always say you got to train at this stuff. There's way more information out there about how to fight with this. Stick fighting, sword fighting, Filipino martial arts, any, anything. Then there is information about this. Yeah. Until I put out my Hammer Time yeah. instructional course, yeah. <laughs> which I have not decided. Is that going to be, it's like real. I started as a joke. I'm doing a course on this soon. It started out as a joke, but like everything in it is real. I don't know how useful it is. So I'll concede that this is better for a lot of reasons. But do you know one problem with it? How are you going to tote this around? How you want to carry it around? Yeah. How do you carry it? Back pocket. Well, I mean... Back pocket? Pants leg. Pants leg? Yeah. It's so the same like, thing with a hammer. I mean, I guess you can, you can conceal a hammer easily, like, I mean, easier. You, you I don't have to conceal a hammer. But people are going to be looking at you like, why is this dude carrying a hammer around? That, 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 yeah! Thank you, Maddox. I put that bitch in a hammer hook. Spray a little bit of paint on so it. And I can go to the club with a hammer. They're not going to stop. I'm you. not. I don't go to the club. <laughs> Carry a gas you're station. Walking towards somebody with a hammer. You can go in the gas station with a hammer and a hammer hook on your hip. You can't go into the gas station okay, with that's this. Fair. That's fair. You can't go in the gas station with a hammer, man. You can go in the gas station with a hammer. I've seen that. Yeah. I mean, you probably can. But I mean, if you if, if you got I a spray, tool belt. now if I if I take a brand new one in there, I can't take that. You know that, and I'm dressed like this. But if you're wearing a pair of jeans and you put a hammer hook on there, yeah. and you just let that thing sit in there. I'm thinking a carpenter's going there after work. <laughs> Maybe they eye you, but they're not going to call the police. If you go in the gas station with a machete right here, they're going to be like, sir, we need you to leave. Yeah. This machete is actually, this is a Schrade machete. I got it. I actually bought it because I, I wanted the trainer. The trainer that I've got. Look at this thing. You guys have seen me playing with this. That's another plus for the machete. If you get a machete, chances are you can find a trainer that matches it. 
I'll put a link down to this one below. It's on Amazon, but this was actually handmade by a guy from Volpe's Training. Like he hand makes trainers to match this. So you'll be able to find training for it. You'll be able to find trainers for it. But don't despair, because there are training hammers. There are training hammers because I have made training hammers, right? <laughs> So I can practice with these things. We can wrestle with these things, which brings me to why I think the hammer, which by the way, I, comment below. What do you think? Hammer, machete, which do you think is better? I think the hammer is better. Clifton, if you'll assist me. Cliff's a little bit familiar with some of this stuff. Yeah, fucking crackhead that's close. Yeah, no, I mean with this stuff. He's been with me for some of this uh -oh. stuff. Right, so I've got this, this machete is humongous. This is a toy. This is not a training machete. This is a. That's a like, like a Walking Dead. No, yeah, yeah, it's a Walking Dead. It's actually the officially licensed Walking Dead ah. Rick Grimes machete. So right here, boom. This is great. Right here, boom. This is great. The problem comes that we don't always pick the range of the fight, right? If he comes to me, now there's going to be people that say that there's, and there's of course stuff you can do with this. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like I'm not saying that you can't, like you can't fight inside with this. It's gonna be difficult. But I have, here, I'll be nice. I have, I have a whole, a whole like plan for, you know, like, um, like stripping grips with this thing. You know what I mean? Hammer time, due out soon. Should I put on Teachable? It's I think you should wear parachute pants. <laughs> parachute pants? Yeah, MC Hammer, he used to wear parachute pants. Oh, I should wear. Go on Hammer time, bro. Um, what do you just grab my wrist? You found me. I just grab whatever the fuck. You, oh, here we go. Yeah, I have a whole, um, here we go. like a whole like system for like stripping grips. Like, go so ahead, grab. You can't do that with this one, right? With what? If someone would. Oh, with the machete. With the machete. Yes, yes, you can. I mean, all, all the same stuff would work, but the I can't look. I can't maneuver it. You but I also feel like if you're, you're, if you're grabbing it, yeah, back. Got. Okay, all right, Ooh. true. I, I just like the hammer better. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think I like the hammer better because it's I'm being contrary. Like, I pull yeah, out I hammer say, machete. Sheldon, hammer or machete, which is better for self-defense? In your opinion. My opinion, I would go for, I would go for machete. Yeah. yeah, I think, I think I just say the hammer to be contrary. But there's like, there's stuff you could do with a hammer that you just can't do with anything else. Grappling with a machete is extremely dangerous to the person with the machete as well. Grappling with the hammer, there's all kinds of cool stuff you can do. I'll tell you, I'll give a sneak peek of the most, one of the techniques from the Hammer Time instructional throughout <laughs> 2025, right? So Nate uh, wants to take me down to the ground. He comes in on a single maybe, whatever, like, uh, yeah, whatever, boom. He's getting stubborn on this single. Now I could, obviously, hammer time, right? <laughs> yeah. But the best technique from hammer time, do you know what an oil check is? No. Yes. Have you ever had your oil check? <laughs> Have you ever had your oil check with a hammer? No. <laughs> Come here. Come here. Come here. Come on. Now he's playing for life. <laughs> check engine lights out, bro. Yeah. <laughs> the hammer. Give me a hammer. Give me a hammer. Give me a hammer. <laughs> yeah, they'll do anything they can to not get their oil checked with that hammer. They'll move and they'll squirm and they'll give you position. But I think that the hammer is better for self-defense than a machete because I think it's cooler and less people are doing it. Is that good enough reason? Sometimes we should just do stuff just for fun. So comment below your thoughts, hammer versus machete. Is anyone out there with me that they think a hammer is better? Yeah. Also, is there anything else you'd like us to look at? I mean, I can see the downfalls of a machete because if you're in a self-defense situation, you can't accidentally cut yourself with it if you're in a struggle. So, there's... Dude, I have so many hammer video ideas, but it's like having a product that there's no market for. Yeah. I want to go to Lowe's and take you to Lowe's and show you how to select a hammer for self-defense. Because this isn't even the best hammer. Say shout out some company figure out a tactical hammer that we can review. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> grappling with a hammer is much like grappling with anything else. You have the same, the same games you play, right? You can frame with it, post with it, 
control limbs with it, pummel with it, you can ankle pick with it, right? But the most devastating hammer grappling technique. You're not gonna put that in the video, are you? Ranga dig a do! That shit can't go in the video. <laughs> <laughs> Could you imagine? Oh. Could you imagine the claws of a claw hammer going in there? Oh, God. Ah! Oh. I had the same exact like thought. Boom! <laughs>